And as part of this year's Mother's Day celebration, some children from selected schools in Accra exhibited some performances to honor their mothers. The event, which is the brainchild of IZ Multimedia Group, was to instill motherly love into the children and also teach them to reciprocate the same love when they grow up. The Deputy Minister for Gender, Children and Social Protection, Madam Rachel Apo, said one area the ministry will tackle vigorously is violence against women. It is Mother's Day, a day celebrated annually to recognize the contributions of mothers to the peace and economic development of their family circles and society at large with the ultimate aim of honoring them. Just as each person has his or her own way of appreciating mothers, these kids also have their own ideas of honoring their mothers. I want to wish her happy Mother's Day. I want to make her the best mother. And I want to give her the gift that she never had before. What gift are you going to buy her? A wedding car. A wedding car? <laughs> wow. And a wedding gown. And a wedding gown. I'm going to bake a cake for her. I'm going to cook for her. I'm going to cook. What kind of food are you going to cook for your mom? Rice. Rice and what? Soup. And soup. Mm -hmm. Okay. In Africa, mothers are considered good managers of the home who instill discipline in their children and guide them to achieve the best in life. Visionary, patience, source of encouragement, and full of inspiration are but just a few of some of the qualities that most mothers are said to possess. In Ghana, the day is celebrated in many forms. This year, iZert Multimedia decided to give mothers a special treat. Some selected children from about 20 schools in the capital exhibited some performances through music and dance just to say a big thank you to the roles their mothers have played and continue to play in their lives. Madame Faustina Abwaji from the Human Resource Division of the Ministry of Education paid tribute to mothers for their roles in educating the child. Some people who spoke to GTV were of the common view that mothers need to be appreciated even more than what has been done. The role mothers play in the society, if we don't even put mothers in the strategic places, the world will not move the way it's supposed to move because the ideas, the divine ideas that God has given to women, they think far and act and reason far ahead before a man would even reason. Men are not men. You know, without mothers, who are we? We all came from them, you understand, and we need to honor them. They are special people. They, are, they were given to us by God, and we need to honor them in every way. I, if I had my own way, I would say, we should have it as a public holiday to honor them. Some of them are single parents, in paying school fees, taking care, having love, you know, and all the stress they have been going through. May the Lord strengthen them and give them long life to look after their child. Because the Bible said children are a blessing to us. So we thank them so much. Deputy Minister for Gender, Children and Social Protection, Madam Rachel Apple, said a word of appreciation for mothers. We have so many single mothers in the system who just suffer, go through a whole lot of challenges to even bring up their children. But in the long run, they are able to do all that, achieve whatever they want to do. So in such occasion, we appreciate them so much. So all measures have been put in place to fight against the abuse of women in this country. And very soon we're going to have, um, let's say, minimal abuse of women in this country. As the world celebrates Mother's Day, it is the wish of many that the mother's courage, commitment, sacrifices, resilience and faith be rewarded at all times, not only on yearly basis.